us another episode of SDS. Wait. Where am I? Where is everyone? Oh, hi. Uh, I just wanted to let you guys know that it's finally happening. It's been a long time coming. SDS are doing our very first live show. Wednesday the 26th of July at Rich Mix in London Shoreditch. Make sure you guys are there. We will be there giving you guys so much entertainment on stage. Everyone will be appearing. All the details will be coming soon. Tickets will be going live this Monday and the link will be on the screen right now. Don't miss out. See you there. Ladies and gentlemen, the time has come. This is the seventh episode. This is the final, the first man to enter this final. After beating Fuizi in the quarterfinal. No competition. Beating Ilias in the semi-final. Big competition. It's Faisal. <laughs> Faisal, anything you want to say to the camera before we enter the final? I'm going to win this. You're going to win. I'm very confident. There we go. And guys, facing him in this final, we have a man who's had maybe, I mean, the streets have been saying a tougher route. He's faced star player in the quarterfinal, overcame that. He then faced abs in the semi-final. We saw how that went. You know how that shit goes. <laughs> he now is here to face face with the finals. Leas! Thank you. Anything you want to say? It's been a, a bumpy road to get here. There were some, some slight doubts after stars took care of business. Mm. There were some question marks. Could abs potentially be a banana peel that you could slip over? We handled that too. And you didn't believe that I would even be here at the end of your episode. You said, Abs, I'll see you there. Well, he's here in the audience watching you. If <laughs> <laughs> you guys here from the series, both, actually, both guys are lost in the semis. They think there's it. a third place game. So yeah, I mean, you, you didn't think you'd face him in the final. No, did, no, did I kind of did. Like, honestly, like, since the whole beginning of the tournament. I don't believe you, because after your first game, you said, I'm only a fearful of one person. Well, who did he say? Who was that? He said, Fuad. Fuad. The second time, he said, I expect to see Abs in the final. Listen, you are the toughest opponent. Mm. I think that uh, like if we go to the betting side, I think you are the, the, the favourite. We'll check the betting odds, wait. Elias is favourite going to this final. Like everyone, yeah. everyone predicted you to the win, so the pressure is on you to deliver. Is it? I'm the underdog here. Ah, that's so. I'm calm with being underdog. <laughs> Madrid last season was an underdog. You know, you know, you know how that happened. You know, yeah. you saw what happened. Guy, what, did, what happened? They, they got knocked out. <laughs> but guys, we are in the final, which means they are playing for some prizes. The first one. This trophy. Okay, pass it to me, bro. Putting his smudgy ass Iraqi hands all over it, bro. <laughs> and he's kissed it before he's it. Uh, no, Could that no, be I'm a curse? Now I gotta desanitize it. Could that be a curse? He's kissed it. And the second thing you're playing for is a prize for a thousand pounds. I mean, I was gonna make a cash, but I thought I'd just send it to you guys about bank transfer. Whoever wins, it's too long to take out cash. So. Obviously, what are you gonna do if you're winning is if you charity straight away. Charity? Look, I got a nice trip to Toronto lined up with the boys. I hope that's paying for my business class there. Mm. And the third thing you're playing for is a ticket mm. to season two. This is a ticket to season two of SDS Football Mastermind. Now, you know, season two will be happening. I'm officially announcing it now. There will be new guests and the winner of this episode is the first competitor to be announced in season two. And this is the ticket. Okay, well, I think we've done enough talking, boys. Mm. I think you guys are ready for the show to start. One thing I want you guys to do though, is if you've been watching the whole season from start to finish, all seven episodes, and you're here now on episode seven, and you haven't pressed subscribe, I don't usually ask for subscribers, then what are you doing, guys? You do? Are you really enjoying it? Press that button, press the notification bell, because the podcast is just as good as the Mastermind series. Also, make sure you leave a comment now on who you think is gonna win, and feel free to play along at home. But we're gonna start the final, and if you don't know, for the very last time, Welcome to SDS Football Mastermind. The rules are simple. There are four rounds and 25 points to play for. Each round is a different format of a football quiz that will test both the contestants' football knowledge and how well they can deal with pressure. Oh, Chappie Alonso! Hey, one man! This is an eight-man tournament, and by the end of the series, only one man will be crowned the SDS Football Mastermind. All right. <clears throat> Good luck, man. You need it, bro. So, boys, this guy's crazy. You know how the game works? This is round one. It is called What Do You Know? You've both had two matches till now. This is your third match, so I'm sure you guys know exactly how this works. So I'm gonna get straight into it. <laughs> Starting with Lias. Remember, there's only th this one is only 20 possible answers. So if you both say all 20, the person with less strikes wins a point. Starting with Lias, can you name me players who are in the top 20 appearance makers in Premier League history? Ryan Giggs. Gareth Barry. James Milner. John Terry. Paul Scholes. Wayne Rooney. Steven Gerrard. Frank Lampard. Mark Schwartzer. Better check. Strike one. 
Rio Ferdinand. No, it's, not, it's too early, bro. It's too early. Uh, Don't tell me it's too early. Ashley Young. Ashley Young? What has been playing for a long time? Gary Neville. <laughs> Gary Neville is also a strike. Pass. Pass. In the first question, you said what? Pass. On the first question. Back to no, you. Just chill, chill, chill. No, no, you can't. You can't be doing this. Wait, 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 wait. chill, chill. Um, um, a bit of a dapper. Strike, Who's been in my All right, so they both used their strikes on the first question. That was tough, right? I'm surprised Gary Neville and Rio were not in there. Uh, I don't see this. I've got the top 20 in front of me. I see no Gary Neville. Wow. All right, it is 1 0 to Lias. The second question. This one is directly related to both your clubs okay. Manchester United and Real Madrid. Do you guys remember the last time you guys played in the Champions League? 2013. Robbery. That second leg, that specific game actually. I'm going to need to hear the players that started in that game. There's 22 names. Yes. Faisal, you start. Cristiano Diego. Ronaldo. Diego Lopez. Higuain. Arbeloa. You start with Matsu. This is your team. Same Respect. Well, last name, Di Maria. Sergio Ramos. Ozil. Varane. Xabi Alonso. Coentrao. Kedera. Uh, Di Maria. Been said, strike one. Okay. Yes! De Gea. Uh, Rafael. Vidic. Rio. Over. Carrick. Wilbeck. Van Persie. Nani. Cleverly. Geeks. That's all the names done. And who had a strike one? I only had the strike. That's it. All 22 names have been said. Fair play, boys. Hey, what a round. Nah, shake hands. You both completely. So I said Di Maria, even though all the Real Madrid players were already named. Di Maria, Di Maria was said twice. You both said Di Maria. Wow. True fans, respect. That was 10 years course, ago. Bro, this guy's trying to throw PSG we allegations. Said cleverly and he said, well, back. I said, wow, respect. All right, so the scores are now 1 1. And now it's a series first. You guys complete the names, but you guys, you got a point based on the strikes. Next. Invincibles. <laughs> Invincible? What? No, no. He's got a point already. <laughs> I got two strikes in it. This guy's head is on Saturn, bro. <laughs> Next question, boys. Back in the Premier League, Elias will start with you. You might have the advantage of this one because you are from Africa. Current. African playing players in the Premier League. Riyad Mahrez. Hamid Salah. El Nani. Ben Rama. Eric Bailly. He's back he at left. United. He's left. back at United. Left. left. You no, said he's still at the club. Left. He's still at the club. He hasn't gone anywhere. He's a Man United player, no? Uh, huh? But, but you said, no, 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 hold on, hold on. Hold on. We based it with, no, 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 no. Eric Bailly is a Man United player. Thank you. Go. What? <laughs> Kuyata. Who's Kuyata? Kuyate. Yeah, I'll give it to you. Yeah. But... Yeah, Nacho. Oh, it's Leicester. Yeah, Nacho. Leicester's been relegated yeah. for using by you for this season. Okay. So hey, hey, strike, strike one. one. So strike one, one. yeah. Okay. Yalo. I'm, I'm at Yalo. Your turn, Yalo. Oh, relax. Um, this is tense. Two. Matip. Babu Rahman. He left. He left today. Strike S one as well. <laughs> Plays for PAOK. Okay. Strike one in Greece. Pass. Oh, I don't have my pass. You've gone. I don't know. Strike two. Agued, what's time? 2 1, Faisal. Ziyech. He left, he left in the Nussel. He hadn't left, he filled his medical, bro. Still there. This guy. Still there. Still there. On the last second, buzzer beater. Mendy. He's gone. No, Saudi. Mendy. Mendy. Okay. Mendy. Okay. Strike two? Two. What are you want? Strike two as well? Yeah. <laughs> um. Nicola Pepe. Oh, yeah. uh, he's back, yeah. back up from loan. He's still an Arsenal player. What? What? Buzzer beater. Wait, wait, what? <laughs> Close I was. One second left I threw on Nicola Pepe. <laughs> Two buzzer beaters. Wow. When I said Ihenacho, low-key I was like, oh, if he checks that, I'm done. <laughs> it is 2-1 to Elias. This is a worthy final, man. See, the cream always rises to the top. We're on the fourth question. Clubs that have won the Europa League, and also formerly known as the UEFA Cup, so since 1972. Um, Seville. Manchester United. Atleti. Porto. Um, Villarreal. Uh, CSK Moscow. Chelsea. Uh, Zenit. Uh, Steel Backrest. No, nope, they won a Champions League, I think they did. Keep, keep digging, bro. <laughs> what year? Yeah. Well, yeah. They've won in the 70s, but I remember it, bro. <laughs> <laughs> he, he thinks he's full, right? <laughs> Bucharest. Do you see Bucharest? Yo, look past 19th no, Bucharest. <laughs> Strike one. Shakhtar Donetsk. PSV. Bayern Munich. Juve. Liverpool. Inter. Ajax. Feyenoord. Uh, Dortmund? Uh, nope. Strike one as well. 
Benfica. No, they got a curse, bro, don't they? No, uh, the, the, it's the Champions League curse. It's, it's a European, it's a European full yeah, stop. Well, and I don't see the Benfica badge. No, Keep do digging. That. Strike two. I'm going to go with... It's too late. Oh, Strike it's what? Two. Two, two. Bismillah ar Braga. Braga? I don't see Braga, although double check just for you. One. No, nope, Braga. It counts, it counts, Inter it counts. Toto. You don't even know what the Inter Toto Cup is. Strike three. The scores are now 3 1. Wow. This game is tough, though, bro. It's a tough okay. run. It's the final, bro. You've got Real Madrid. No, no, Real Madrid won it. 85 and 86. 85 and 86. You have for cup winners. <laughs> know your club, please. <laughs> this one is tough, but they've all been tough. There's only 13 possible answers here. So similar to the last one, if you clear them, we have less strikes, gets the point. Players who have played under both Pep Guardiola and Jose, the special one, Mourinho. Okay, it's Latin. That's a... Uh, <sighs> De Bruyne. Pedro. Fabregas. Next one. Uh, Strike one. Ricardo Cavalier. Strike one. Uh, wow. Two. Yeah, no. Strike two. Keep fine, bro. You're fine. Bro. Robin. Bro. Robin. I said Robin at the, at the oh, I said Robin at the buzzer. I said Robin at the buzzer. Hey, I did. On my life, I did. Some showtime thing. Oh, what are you doing? On my life, I did. You do some showtime thing. Yeah. Showtime. Am I doing this? On my life, I did. Snyder. Strike three. Do some showtime thing. You're lying, man. Just put, just put your hand quick, like. What are you complaining about? With me straight over for five, bro. Come on, man. As you guys can see, this is what is called a sore loser. <laughs> I'm saying how on my, it is. On my life right now, I'm amazed I just did that. I'm saying how On my life, I'm amazed I just did that. Who, do, who did we miss? 13 uh, Oh! Chappie Alonso! I won, man! <laughs> is Alonso the high one? Chappie <laughs> Alonso. And uh, the score's going to round two. Is 4-1. It doesn't feel like 4-1. On, like, on my life, it doesn't feel like 4-1. You snatched two of those four points. At the death. At the death. Multiple times. Guys, see you in round two. All right, it is now time for lies. This is the round where I'm gonna say a topic. They both have to say how many of that topic they can name in 30 seconds. The other person has a chance to say they can name more or they can call the other person a liar. At that point, whoever said they can name that certain amount of thing in the topic has to go for it in 30 seconds. They get it, they get the point. If they don't, the other person who called them a liar gets the point. So for this one, you can't go higher than 19. I'm gonna go back and forth, yeah? Can you name me teams? that have gone to a Champions League final since 2000? Uh, five. Six. Seven. Eight. Nine. Ten. Eleven. Twelve. Thirteen. Fourteen. Fifteen. Lies. All right, so FaZe is going to attempt to name 15 teams that have been in the Champions League final since 2000. In three, two, one, go. City, Inter, Chelsea, um, Real Madrid, Liverpool, Barcelona, Bayern Munich, Juventus, AC Milan, Dortmund, um, uh, Monaco, Porto, uh, Valencia, uh, Bayern, uh, uh, Porto, I said Porto, Arsenal, Chelsea's in there, Liverpool's in there, United's in there. I'm gonna stop you, you've done it. The scores are now 4-2. Maybe you could've done that myself. He made it look easy, jeez. Yeah, that was good. All right, next one. How many managers can you name that have managed an international team, past or present? Five. Okay, uh, six. Seven. Eight. Nine. Ten. Eleven. Twelve. 13. 14. 15. 16. Driving each other up here. It's a mental battle. I'm going to push you for an answer, Lias. 17. Cat. Well, it's called life. <laughs> 17. 3, 2, 1, go. Zagallo, Scolari, Dunga, uh, Carlos Alberto Pereira, Deschamps, uh, uh, Le Maire, Aimé Jacquet, uh, Laurent Blanc, Southgate, uh, Sam Allardyce, Joachim Love, Jurgen Klinsmann, uh, Scaloni, uh, Maradona, Beckenbauer, Platini, um, uh, Lippi, uh, Mancini. Is that it? Wow. Wow. <laughs> wow. <laughs> and it was funny as well. It was like, it was like naming some like, European beautiful names. It goes yeah, Southgate, <laughs> Allardyce. I was like, oh, he's ruined it. Scores are now 5 2. As of last season, season I just finished, there's 18 max, by the way. 18. How many teams that competed last season in the Portuguese league can you name? Yeah, right. You love that league. How do you do Euro talk? Uh, three. I'm not good at Portuguese league though. Four. Five. Six. Seven. Cap. Seven Portuguese teams in 30 seconds starts in three, two, one, go. 
Braga, Sporting Lisbon, Porto, Benfica, Rio Ave, uh, Boavista, Morienze, Tondela. That's it, that's eight, fam. Finish it. Well done. The scores are now 5 3. Still close. Scores are now 5 3, but the, the questions are still tough. <laughs> Portuguese league is tough. And it's still that third round where someone can really. Third round is usually where this game is on a lost. Next question, question number four for lies. There's a max of 11 possible answers here. How many Club World Cup winners since 2000 can you name? There's 11. Four. Four? Five. Five. Six. Seven. Eight. Nine. Cap. Lies. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> no, 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 we're gonna change it. We're gonna change it to, to cap next. And three. Two, one, go. Inter, Real Madrid, Barcelona, Bayern Munich, Liverpool, United, Chelsea, Flamingo, uh, uh, I think Corinthians, uh, El Ahli, uh, Dolman won it, uh, uh, um, uh, Monaco was in the, uh, um, Milan was in the, uh, how long left? Milan was in the, he won it, oh, three was won it, uh, Barcelona won it, United won it, Liverpool won it, Inter won it, Juventus, Juventus didn't win it, uh, uh, yeah, Bayern, Real Madrid. Okay, time is up. So let me tell you what's going on. No, no, time is up. So let me tell you what just happened, right? So you named eight, you said they're going to do nine. You named eight that definitely won it. Okay. Right? Now this depends on what the jury says. He named eight definitely. He said Corinthians. I've never heard of them. Brazilians. But I know who he means. Corinthians. But that, Corinthians have won it. You meant Corinthians, right? Yeah, Cor yeah. Corinthians have won it. Yeah. So you've got nine. So you've passed. So the scores are now 5 4. That was a very, very solid one from you. This is a solid round from you, Faisal, because if you win this last one of lies, it's 5 5. Yeah, and you, you both beat each other 4 1 each in the first two rounds. Wow. What a final. What a series. What a channel. Please subscribe. Okay, so the last question of lies. Who am I going to? There's a maximum of 15 possible answers, so you can't go by 15 for your lies, right? So, similar question to what you had in your semi-final guess apps. Mm. Different player. How many clubs can you name that Rivaldo played for? Two. Three. Easy and confident. Four. Five. Six. Cap. Did he just bluff you and is confident and made you call him Cap? Yeah, I'm gonna just name random teams, bro. How about you name the right ones? <laughs> this just seems like he's just guessing, right? Oh, Football guesser. Are you, are you, are you that rattled? Fuck, you know. Six teams that Rivaldo's played for in 30 seconds, please. In three, two, one, go. Barca, Real, um, Debatio, Lovconia, Valencia, uh, Mallorca, Sao Paulo, Flamengo, Cotrientes, Atletico Mineiro, Santos, Victoria, uh, 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 where else did you go, bro? Uh, I'm sure you went to uh, Inter, AC, UV, Roma. Uh, uh, PG, Leon, Marseille, Lille, I don't know. If I'm... Time, and no, you don't get, you didn't even get six. You got about four. You said Real Madrid as well, yeah, you know? Second team, what did you think for Real Madrid? How about you answer the question about you just guess? Huh? You didn't get that. But the scores are now 6-4 after the first two rounds. It is still very close because the next round is a round where the scores can change drastically. So to be two points in it still is very, very good. See you guys in the next round. Okay, guys, it is now time for round three. This is the buzzer round. Well, I keep calling it buzzer round. We actually have a bell, so. In this round, I'll ask some very simple football-related questions, not as tough as the first two rounds, but the aim of the game is to press the bell as quick as you can. If you press it before I finish speaking, I will stop speaking, because the bell basically means shut up, Sharky, I know the answer. You get to answer it. If you get it wrong, I will finish the question and the next person gets to answer you are frozen out. You then get one more guess each and then that question is void and the video goes from 25 maximum points to 24. Mm. Okay? I'm gonna use my phone so I can see the bell properly. You're the best man right win. Now. This round is where I think the winner could be crowned. The 2022 World Cup was held in Qatar. What's the answer? No, no, just keep going. <laughs> What's the answer? Well, why did I do that act? What's man? the answer? Uh, the 22 uh, World Cup was held in Qatar. Uh, in which stadium? I don't, I don't tell me the question, don't the answer. What was the, uh, what was the score in the final? Oh. What was the score in the final? 3-3 free, free, extra time penalties. You're out anyways, you're done. I get to finish the question, you're frozen out. This is a long question, you should listen to it. The 2022 World Cup was held in Qatar. Name the only other side to host the tournament without previously uh, competing in the tournament. South Africa? Correct. Who won the Man of the Match award for the 2014 World Cup final? That is Faisal. That's me. Yes, I said that. Yeah, yeah, that's me. So what's the answer? It's me, yeah? Ozil. Incorrect. Mario Gozza. Correct. 
Mario Götze won it after one goal. He came with the extra time, bro. How did he win it after extra time? Take it up with the organizers, not sure. Take it up with them. The scores are now 8 4. Which football club, and Faisal, I'm expecting you to get this one. Which football club did David Beckham. Manchester United. Incorrect. I get to finish the question. Which football club did Faisal's favorite football of all time, David Beckham, play for last? Paris Saint Germain. Correct. <laughs> Paolo Di Canio is the all time top scorer in the Premier League for which club? What's that? Correct. 86. Which Manchester United player has scored goals in 10 consecutive Premier League? Ruud van Nistelrooy. Correct. In 1990, which team failed to score a single goal in the World Cup final? Argentina. Correct. Say final, uh, quick on man. I thought he was going to say the tournament. <laughs> say final, quick on man. I'm sorry I can't say quick on. It scores are now 10 6. Three more points for the whole rest of the video will get you the win. What British team was the first to win the European Cup? That's the winner. Incorrect. Celtic. Correct. Yes. Wow. Did you, did you say British or English? British. Yeah, I said Are you British. sure? Everyone heard British. Hey, did, yes. did, 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 did everyone hear? Did everyone hear British? British? Focus is 11-6. Everyone heard British. Don't be like this, bro. Don't go down. Don't don't go outside, bro. <laughs> Which country won the first ever? Which country won the first ever World Cup? Uruguay. Correct. Wow. There you go. There you go. Wow. Wow. <laughs> There's a lot of exasperation that just came out of him right there. 11 7. What team did Wayne Rooney score in, in his debut? Everton. Uh, Arsenal, Arsenal, Arsenal. Correct. <laughs> <laughs> wow, and there's one more question left of this round. So focus, if you get this to 11 9, it's still close in the last round. Who is the owner of Real Valid? We have Valid dude, it's Ronaldo. Part of right. <laughs> Questions. We are down to the final round of five questions of guess the player, and they're both still in it. See you in the final round. All right, guys, we are now down to the final round. The scores are 11 9. There's five questions left, which means if Elias gets two out of the next five, he wins, and he's the winner of Football Mastermind Season 1. He only needs 13 to win. Faisal, you still have a bit of a mountain to climb, but you left yourself in a good position after the last round, so good job. The way this round works, I will name a player's career path. I will let them know if they are active or retired. If they press the buzzer or the bell, I stop speaking. They get a chance to guess the player. If they get it wrong, I then finish the career path and the other person gets to work out the player. This one, let's see if your quick hands work or not. Because if you get it wrong, then the other person has the whole career, man. This is, this is a tough one. All right, the first player, he is currently active. Starts career at Lille. Started playing in the B team first, but then went to the first team. So Lil. He then went to PSG. He then went on loan to Roma. Then he signed to Barcelona. Uh, 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 so you all you heard is Lil, PSG, Barcelona, and Roma. That's up. Incorrect. You're frozen out. I'm going to say the rest of the career. Be patient, act. You think you know it, yeah? After Barcelona, he signed for Everton. He then signed for Aston Villa. Lucas Dinia. Lucas Dinia is correct. You're one point away from being oh, crowned. No. Next player, he's also active. This could be a winning point. He started at Lech Poznan. From Lech Poznan, he signed for Legia Warsaw. Lewandowski. Incorrect, you are frozen out. Basil, you need this one. So we went to start Lech Poznan, he then signed for Legia Warsaw. From Legia Warsaw, he signed to Arsenal. After Arsenal, he went to Swansea, and then he went to West Ham. He's only got time in a second. Oh, I was so sick. Lech Legia Warsaw, Arsenal, Swansea, West Ham now. He's a West Ham now, he's active, active, active all the time. Active, 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 active. Wow. Damn. 
This is the name that comes out of your mouth. It's to finish it off. Fuck it couldn't be Lucas Fabianski. Oh! It's Lucas Fabianski. So, Lias has won. The score is 13 9. I mean, there's was, there was, there was three questions left, but I don't know if we need to do it. I don't think he's really in the mood to do it. I think it's time we just crown you the champion. Oh my days, so, man. No, first of all, Faisal, shake my hand, bro. That's a battle, that's a battle for the ages, bro. Do you want to do the last few questions so you can get a final score? So, no. Elias, congratulations. You are the winner of SS Football Mastermind Season 1. Your £1,000 will be transferred to you. Your, your contract, your ticket to Season 2, signed by myself, is here. Make sure you keep that safe. You need to, I'm going to put it, I'm going to frame it. Honestly, I'm going to frame it. Frame it. And the last thing left for you to do, you didn't touch this earlier. No. Faisal touched it, you kissed no. it. Last thing you have to do is hold this. There's your camera. When you're ready. Vamos! Let's go! Vamos! Oh my days, man. Oh my days, man. Yo, I'm sweating, bro. Let's go. Let's go, man. Wow. Wow. For those who believed in me, here's the evidence. For those who didn't, try next season. That is now yours. Go. <laughs> I'm gassed, bro. Shout out to everyone who competed in this season. Mm -hmm. I think even the people who like went out early or whatever, everyone did their thing. I mean, star player, I thought I was going to be star player, but yeah. it shocked me. And Faisal, bro, we, we spoke in my studio that one time. We knew this was going to be the final. Yeah. And bro, you pushed me to the end, man. Honestly, that could have gone either way. Congrats, bro. <laughs> I don't think this. So Fair enough. I, I would be upset if I had to lose too. Yeah, no, I know. I know. Upset. There's upset, but yeah. now it's like there's upset, but there's like this. You know, champion that's disrespectful. That's, yeah, that's not even like a you are you are, you are a real champion. You did well. None of that. Bye, bye, bye. Thank you, thank you. Shut the fuck up and just enjoy, enjoy. Oh, hey. All right, guys, that is the end of season one of STS One Masters. My thank you so much for everyone that's been tuning in throughout the whole series. It's been special. It's the first season that we've done on STS, any type of series we've done. So I thank you guys so much. I count this as, as a successful season. So thank you so much to everyone. We'll be back for season two. So please leave a comment for who you want to see on season two. Lias has already got the first spot, but we need seven more names. Let's go, man. <laughs> for the final time, guys, goodbye. I'll see you next season. Let's go.